Hi everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to add a student annotation as an assignment. So we're going to go to the plus assignment, create assignment, and here I'm showing you this how to use the student annotation submission type. So we're going to go ahead and select it, edit. Now the student annotation is great if you want the students to write on a PDF. So you can upload a PDF that you already have and the students can answer right there. Another way is if you upload an article, the students can annotate it. So annotating an article, so this is a skill the students need. And you can have this in assignment where you can grade it. So here you put the, uh, the points, the assignment group. Now the submission type is online. Then student annotation. So here I'm going to upload in an article from my computer. But you can always use a file that's already on there. So where the students can grade an assignment. So now I'm going to show you what it looks like. So I'm going to leave the student view for now. And when you upload it, this is what it looks like. You have the 10 points, the student annotation. So now I'm going to go to student view. They start it. And here they can use all these tools. These double arrows makes the screen go bigger. Um, they can also download the article. But if they stay here on Canvas, they can make the annotations right on here. So they can leave comments on specific areas. And here they type. They can write text, so they can highlight and write a text anywhere. And they can also mark up anything and add comments. And they can also select and write comments based on that selection. The only ones that they're not able to use is the highlighting tool and the strike through but everything else is fair grain so here i'm leaving a comment and i'm going to show you what it looks like in the speed grader so we're going to hit submit and you go to the speed grader and here you can see all the annotations that the student has made and of course you can also always write comments grade it and leave any feedback that you may want. And I hope this was helpful.